everyone, my name is Cheyenne and I am the creator of Kitty Cat Shy, or a lot of people say Shay, but it's Shy. <laughs> um, so this is my first time doing a voiceover for my videos, I've been planning it for a while now, but I never got around to it. Mostly because I don't know how to talk to a microphone, funny enough I work in a call center so it should be second nature, um, but I guess that's another person on the line. <laughs> um, so. I guess I should talk about the art a little bit here, so I can barely see it because I'm watching it in the video editor, which is kind of weird, but um, I still know what's going on anyway, I guess I did the art, but I'm drawing Sailor Moon, of course, or I guess coloring at this point, but I really love Sailor Moon. Sailor Moon was my childhood hero growing up. Um, of course, uh, for the 90s version, I can never watch the Japanese version because it just isn't right because I grew up with the English version. Um, and I know there was that, like, rip-off of Sailor Moon that, uh, the US tried to do. I, I saw it once, that's it. And, like, I haven't even seen the actual episodes or anything. I watched, like, um, a clip of it on Instagram. And I was like, oh my god, this is trash. I'm so glad I never saw this as a kid. Um, but anyway, back to the Sailor Moon drawing, I guess. Well, um, but anyway, yeah, she was my childhood hero, and lately I've just been obsessing over her. Like, I I've read all the manga now before I started watching Crystal, and the only reason I can even stand Crystal is because it's so closely related to the manga, unlike the 90s version. Like, I'm pretty sure they added stuff just to make it longer. I don't know that for a fact, but that's my guess on why they did that. But the 90s version would always clo uh, uh, sorry, hold a place in my heart. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I, I, in this video I'm using Copics and brush markers, or pro markers, whatever you want to call them. Um, I also whipped out my, um, Prismacolor pencil crown, or pencil, oh my gosh, I don't know the American word for colored pencils, there we go, I'm so Canadian. But anyway, yeah, I'm, my name is Cheyenne, also I guess I should introduce myself finally. I do live in Canada, I'm in Ontario. Um, I have been drawing seriously, I guess, for over five years now, since 2011, so yeah, I guess that would be five years. Um, coming on six in 2017, I guess. I, I was in high school when I started, um, and I'm still... I actually, uh, I actually have disgras uh, sorry, dysgraphia, um, and that's actually a disability with my motor skills, so getting my hand to control any pencil, pen, anything like that is a lot harder. Um, so I thought I would never be able to draw really, but I can, like I still can't write properly, it still looks like a scribbled kindergarten writing. <laughs> um, and actually from right from grade two, I believe it was. I was on a computer for everything I did in school um, because I just couldn't write. I can't get myself to control my hand. Um, and I also, I, I well, I guess my job, I, like I said before, I work at a call center and all of our work is done on computers. So I guess I got pretty lucky there. I don't have to write anything. Actually, paper and pen is banned, so. <laughs> I got pretty lucky there. Um, but yeah, so it's a little bit about myself. Oh, and I guess a little bit, I am engaged to my fiance. His name is Noah. I have a dog named Yoka, and she's Collie Chow Mix. And I also have a kitty cat. Well, actually, it's my fiance's cat, but I'm taking care of him. Um, because right now, we sadly don't live together, but that would be because I'm broke. Sadly broke. Um, but yeah, I, my dream is to be a self-employed artist, like, I, I just love art, I just love sitting there, just drawing, coloring. I want to get into paint, but I really like my markers. Um, so yeah, uh, another thing about me, I am really weird. <laughs> I am really weird. I sound awkward, probably, and my voice sounds like a ten-year-old boy, but you know. Um, but yeah, on this piece I actually tried out something new with my coloring. Um, I did, for the white clothes, I always use my gray Copics, but I was like, you know what, no, I wanna, I wanna have a look. 
but I didn't have the proper Copics because all my purple Copics are out of ink and I haven't bought ink refills yet and I don't have any actually I might have some purple brush markers but I might have lost them because I'm terrible with memory <laughs> um, so I probably bought them and then put them somewhere and I'm like oh great um, but I've never lost art supplies outside of that but yeah, it looks like we're uh, coming to the end here, so um, it was very nice meeting you all in the way. I hope you guys continue to watch my videos, and yeah, if you like my art, uh, subscribe for more. I'm going to try to post more. I just have a horrible computer, so <laughs> that's why I haven't really been posting. But yeah, uh, that's my Sailor Moon drawing, and I hope you guys come again. Uh, other than the people who I guess are subscribed to me. So thank you so much for your support. I love you guys. Alright, so thank you so much and have a great day. Bye.